Okay. Mm. Okay, so I just woke up and my mom's always like, the morning phase is the most important phase because your thoughts are the most organic. So I'm awake in the morning. I'm laying in bed. The lighting in my room is awful, so this is why it is so hard for me to get up in the morning because they just look awful. Let's go be curious. Oh God. Oh God. Wait, the lighting just got significantly like worse in the morning time, which is my favorite time of day because I think it's the most acceptable time of day to do nothing, and I appreciate that, but I have done nothing this morning. I <laughs> have done nothing this morning. But um, what was I gonna say? My mom says that the morning time is the thought time of day where your thoughts are the most organic. So I am going to follow her stead and be curious. Like there's just things that like don't make any sense and I'm gonna question society because, so we're required to live here, but you're not gonna make sure anything makes sense. You're not gonna make sure the building blocks make sense. You know, like children are dying and <laughs> strangers have guns, but that's fine for you, but yeah. I have a list that I have not compiled, which I'm gonna do so right now because I am a dumb bitch. Also, um, since I just woke up, I was simply not going to do my hair. I was simply not going to do my hair. Don't worry about this. This is a microphone. I, my other microphone broke, so we're using row to go But yeah, my, I just woke up. I don't really do a lot in the morning. I typically like focus on myself. I might work out, but I'm not gonna do maintenance. I brush my teeth, that's a lot. I've not had coffee. I'm not one of the people that are obsessed with coffee, but I I do respect her place in the morning. You know, it's very hard to make people feel a certain way and coffee somehow does that. The first aggressor on my list is, is quite possibly one of the most icon iconic, iconic, iconic. I love writing furiously, it's like my favorite. Is, <laughs> I should have wrote it better, it's box cereal. I have a bone to pick with her. The, this cereal is God tier. This cereal has done everything, it, like literally it pulls up, it pulls every, this cereal is God tier. It pulls out every single stop, every single time. She does not miss. I am allergic to almonds and this is the only one they sell at my local Costco. So I just pick out the almonds and every time I do that, it is worth it because it is so fucking good. Hear me out, hear me out, hear me out. Coming from a large lazy family, it's sort of wild to think that like, like I appreciate that the box, the top is resealable. Why is the bag not? See, this is almost gone. This is the last bag. We need to go back to Costco. My family loves Costco. We're almost, it's almost over. Why, why is the top not resealable? That is not my responsibility. It should not be my responsibility. My responsibility is to pay for the product. Your responsibility, who makes this? Is it Kellogg's? No, it's Post. Post. Your responsibility is to make this as good of an experience as it could possibly be and make the bag resealable. But I'm gonna still buy it anyway because it's good cereal, but just know that I would be a lot more pleased if you made the boxes resealable. Thank you and please. I might just be talking about breakfast food this entire video because it is breakfast time. And I love breakfast, especially like pancakes. I don't really like waffles that much and take it up with yourself. The next culprit on this list is an innocent, an innocent perpetrator. They have tried and failed to make it a good experience. And I'm going to say, I'm going to call out bagels. <laughs> My handwriting, it just gets weirder and weirder. You know what? I'm not even mad at the fact that these are not, like these bags are not resealable. I'm mad at the fact that cinnamon raisin should be your best seller. You got like, I think that we as a society need to advance to the point where we can all enjoy a cinnamon raisin bagel. Because what do you mean you're eating a plain bagel? Even everything bagels, I'm like, miss, miss, miss. But you know who never misses? Best friend, cinnamon raisel. She eats every time. She's always soft and good and I, I can support her. I know that if I vote for her for president, she will erase student loan debt. She will, I know. I know, she will not lie to us. She will not Joe Biden us. And that is why we should vote for cinnamon raisin bagels for 2024. Also, please vote for president in 2024. We're not sure who's running. Honestly, it could be anyone's game, but like genuinely fingers crossed that it's someone that, you know, can read. On to the next part of this list. 
this list is going to take a sharp turn because we are out of the food realm, even though we are barely there. We are going to be talking about a dear, dear friend of mine. Just kidding. She's not very dear to me, but I appreciate her in society. We are talking about make. <laughs> I don't even know why I'm showing you this list because this list is just probably like backwards and hard. Right? Ignore that. Ignore that. That's not who we're talking about. We're talking about me. I wish I was good at makeup. I think when most people are like, oh, you're into makeup, it comes from a place of jealousy because like makeup is hard to do. And like, yeah, why we like, well, children shouldn't be doing it. It's like, it's hard to do. So like, if you can do makeup, props to you. Makeup, compacts. This does not need a zipper. I thought it needed a zipper, but it does not need a zipper because honestly, this is so, that's nice. I've, I've gotten this, I got this compact like a few months ago and I've still not taken off the mirror because I just use my own mirror, but like on the go, I probably will if I ever go anywhere ever again because gas prices are insane. Why is it called makeup? Simple question, like why is it called makeup? And what does that say about our society? Why is it called makeup? What about this is made up? I would put it on, but it is seven, it is 7 a.m. So I'm not going to put it on. But like, what about this is like made up? Like it's a very real concrete substance. And I like makeup, like why, like let's call it face paint. There's a race when they call that, isn't there? Let's call it face. Oh my God. I had a thought in my head and she will come back. I had a thought in my head and she will come back. Do not worry. We will see her again. Oh my God, maybe I, I think I just need to hold my eyeliner. I love eyeliner. I think it's so cute to have this thought that I cannot, where's my eyeliner? I use e.l.f. I use e.l.f. eyeliner and it like comes off after like an hour or two, but it's $3. So I don't know what I expected, but let's call it face decor, decor or aesthetic. Let's call it visual self care or just call it what it is face paint. But like, I, I don't understand why it's called makeup. I'm personally offended. Should I keep using the notebook? I think I should. I think it's sort of awful. And I think that's the point of it. Okay. I'm running out of Sharpies. I feel like from the second you get a Sharpie, you're running out of Sharpies because you like, they're so great and you will lose them along the way. They will die along the way. Like it's, it's sort of just like the brand. Like you will lose your Sharpies and you will buy more Sharpies and you will be okay with that because they are Sharpies. The next issue is I am not even like that big into buying coffee. I'll make it in my house because girl, these gas prices, I'm not going anywhere to get coffee and I live in the middle of nowhere. So it's simply not happening. But when I was at college, I bought this Starbucks cup. Very cute, very cute, matte, everything that a girl would want. Tall, a woman, <laughs> kidding. you never know what you're gonna do, but um, yeah, but like why does, it came with this straw and this is, this call is irregularly shaped just like my head. Look, very irregularly shaped. My head is not normal. I am not a normal person. Please help me. Please send like tangerines or something. So you cannot easily replace the straw and yet they have found a way, yet they didn't like make it coverable. So like whatever touches the straw is going into your body, which sucks, which is why I haven't used this cup in like two months even though it is so mad dang dudley dong cute. That is my complaint. You can do better product design. You are a billion dollar company. There are just as many Starbucks in America as there are McDonald's and that's a flex and I'm proud of you and I genuinely hope you know how cool that is because that's, that's an accomplishment. That's really good. That's an accomplishment. And my last bone is a pick with the United States government. It's a very deep, deep issue that I'm having, but I think this is better taken in a different setting. It is morning time. So there is so much time in the day to do whatever you want. And I think that I'm going to use this time to do whatever I want. There's a state named Nebraska. And why is it not a main character? Like, why does it allow California and Florida to be main characters? So like, I think I'm going to move to Nebraska to fix that problem. I'm chaotic enough to make another state Florida. So I think it'll work. Shit, no, 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 it's raining, it's raining, it's raining, it's raining, it's raining. My hair is not braided, I'm not ready for this. I gotta go, I gotta go, I gotta go. <laughs> huh? Okay, so I proved my mom wrong and did something in the morning and it's the last thing I'll ever do. My camera is dying and the video is over. I'm still in my pajamas. I'm gonna go drink some coffee because I respect her.